Hey guys, it's Zach Tidy here. Uh, I just wanted to comment on the video about The Rock uh, finally making a response to what John Cena said to him overseas in Australia. Apparently The Rock covered some things that uh, we already knew, but you know, because he has a lot of haters because there was a lot of people who pretended or, or you know, they fell in love with The Rock when he come back and then because he left they felt betrayed so they wanted to switch sides or whatever, you know, it's bullshit, but you know, what's The Rock going to do when he's in fucking WWE? What do y'all expect him to do? You know, what, y'all want him to wrestle every night? He's not going to do that. He's already did all that. He's done it. It's been done. It's done been said. If you watch any of my old videos, I, re I say that in the older videos that I have. Okay, in my other channel I had, I used to say that shit all the time. Alright, that's why he wouldn't come back. He's already done it. You know, um, other than that, he goes after Cena. You can see the video, it's everywhere. Um, if you guys, you know, are a member of Wrestling Debate and Open Forum, uh, you can see the video. I will put the video in there. Um, for everybody to see. Um, it'll go up to this video. It will go up in the page as soon as this video is being uploaded, so you guys can be prepared for that. Um, it, it's pretty interesting, you know. Uh, you say the Rock's not around, but he is around because he's mentioned all the time. You know, CM Punk's always saying his name, John Cena's saying his name. You know, he's been mentioned more and more in the last few weeks. So yeah, he's not going anywhere. And to think that he is, 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 uh, is insanity. Um, he is going to come back into the WWE, and he's going to do what he's got to do when it needs to, and don't be surprised if he doesn't show up. And the other surprise is, what I'm going to, what I'm going to tell you guys right here is, okay, is check this shit out. What if I told you Mick Foley could be returning as soon as money in the bank? Well, as I reported on this, I told you guys when he left from a source that I had, told me this. I reported it. If you look at my older videos, go back and look. I reported this. McFoley is coming back to the WWE, and he could be coming back at Money in the Bank because he said on Twitter that he thinks about buying a ticket to, to Money in the Bank just to get a, a, a feel of the atmosphere. Well, we usually know what that means, okay? How many wrestlers actually buy tickets and sit in the audience and some shit don't happen? Come on now. I want to see him back. Well, come on back. Come on back, man. Come on back. We love to have you back in the WWE. Come back with your fans, want you? He did not like... TNA, he did not like where they were going with the creativity, and we all knew that. Most people don't. You know what? TNA could be a better company if they get rid of that moron Vince Russo, the fucking dumb shit, okay? He's a hindrance. And I know you get your fans that say, well, you know, he wrote um, storylines in WWE. Yeah, but let me tell you something. When he was in WWE, he had his balls in the vice. Okay, he didn't have free fucking reign. That's why the storylines were idiotic. So don't give me that horse monkey shit. We don't want to hear that stupidity. You know, we don't want to. We don't want to hear that shit. TNA can be a company, and I want them to succeed. Everybody wants TNA to succeed. Everybody likes to have an alternative, but we don't like to watch an alternative that's retarded. Okay, even the new Sting. I mean, come on. I don't have a problem with the Joker Sting. The problem that I do have with it is not the character, but the faces he makes. It's like it's the Joker in Jim Carrey. He makes these hokey faces and it's just retarded. You know, and I don't like it. And I'm not the only one. It's not that he's doing the whole fucking Joker thing. Because, you know, we got past it when he did the dead guy. You know, he likes to take dead guys for something. So what? It's entertaining. What I have a problem with is the fake. You know, he did the crow thing, which was cool. You know, we all know Brandon, um, Brandon Lee was the crow and he died. And, you know, and, and Heath Ledger was the Joker and he died. Now, some people have said it's not the Dark Knight Joker. 
it's the Jack Nicholson Joker. But, you know, it's obvious they took scenes from the movie. But, anyways, I'm not going to go there. I'm not going to get in that debate. You know, it's just a crazy thing. I'm going to get back to that aggression and making Foley thing. Cactus Jack is as I like to refer to him as Cactus Jack. I would love to see him back in the WWE. Wouldn't it be something if he become the raw uh, anonymous general manager? Oh yes, he worked at TNA the whole time, and he was what a storyline. I don't think I want What a storyline that would be. Anyway, guys, once again, we call we come to a close of the video. Uh, the other thing I wanted to let you guys know is, is I've got a, I'm in the works, and I can go ahead and tell you what I'm doing. I'm in the works of doing a uh, wrestling special. Um, I'm going to do one once a month. I'm going to promote a couple of wrestling companies. Uh, I'm going to help them out a little bit. That's that's the big news. Um, I'm just waiting for uh, a couple of them to send me uh, videos. To, uh, and then I can start making videos and stuff, so be in the look. It's going to be in the fall sometime before I do this other, before I start these uh, wrestling specials. Um, look for them sometime. I, I'm going to try to start doing them sometime around October or November, but they're going to be really, really classy. They're going to be 30 minutes, and I'm not sure that they're going to be on YouTube. I'm working on maybe uh, broadcasting them over maybe Justin TV. I know they're going to be on a, a local cable channel here, um, but I'm definitely working on um, maybe doing some broadcasting over Justin TV um, because I can have a longer play time and I can do more stuff there. I'm going to maybe even do some start doing some stand-up comedy stuff because I, I really like stand-up comedy. And uh, so I may have another channel pop up pretty soon for you guys for an alternative to this, you know, so I can do, I want to maybe do some skits and stuff. So I'll be looking for that. And um, remember, you can go to Wrestling Debate and Open Forum and become a member of that group. You can friend me on uh, Todd Star on Facebook, or you can follow me on Twitter. Uh, it's a real Todd Star, real is spelled R L Z. Or you can go down below here. Down below. Subscribe, become a friend, leave a comment, like it, dislike it. Um, it don't really matter since shoot me a message, shoot me comments, um, shoot me anything, shoot all over me, it don't matter. Uh, whatever you guys want to do, uh, I just wanted to say that remember that. Um, Adrian Adonis loves you. Roddy Roddy Popper hit Jimmy Snook in the head with a coconut. And I'm hot toddy. And I'm out. Peace. If you go down below and you subscribe to my show, I will have to show up at your door and kick it in. Subscribe.